to meet here today man what's your name man uh, raymond ortiz raymond how you doing today man how's life treating you so far uh, i'm doing fine it's, it's been good it's been good yeah life's been good it's been good man how old are you john i'm 28 28 years old okay originally where are you from uh, rockport texas rockport how'd you end up over here in corpus uh, rehab uh i came up to corpus to get some rehab and i had family up here uh had two uncles working uh, doing major uh, business here in Corpus, and uh, uh, we we came uh, to Corpus a lot when we were younger. So that's that's what brought me to Corpus, and I just love Corpus. Oh, okay. So you came down, kind of like trying to get some help, some with uh, help and, and business, you know, business with my uncles. So, hey John, so what are your current situations right now? And well, how, currently, how I'm homeless, uh, dealing with a. Uh, Addiction and uh, okay, uh, a little bit of other problems, but a lot, yeah, a lot uh, of right now I don't feel like uh, uh, expanding them or you know, uh, oh, okay. uh, yeah, but that's, that's pretty much all, all, all what I'm going through right now. Yeah, what's a typical day for you look like, John? As soon as you wake up in the morning, you know, I'm trying to happy, eat. joyful, it's joyful. good, it's uh, okay. Um, I try, I, I, for some reason, I always wake up in a blessed mood. I don't ever, like they say, wake up in the wrong side of the bed. I oh, jump up uh, happy. Yeah. <laughs> kind of, I always try to put a smile on my face. It's hard to just see me uh, with, uh, with a uh, frown, you know. Right. But, uh, uh, my dad would always wake up like that, so yeah. yeah. I, trying to, I guess. Try to uh, wake up in a positive uh, attitude to face another uh, day. Huh? Yeah, I mean. I guess some, sometimes it's hard to wake up like that, but I mean, you know, I, 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 I just find it, I mean, easy just when I wake up, it's just a blessing to be up. No doubt. But sometimes I feel like, damn, I don't want to wake up. Right. And that's especially whenever I'm on the dope, you know. Okay. And then I'm out on the streets, you know, I wake up like that. So as far as you trying to, uh, uh, support your habit uh do you what do you do man uh you boost you uh panhandle uh, yeah uh, i support my habit by panhandling uh uh asking for money and uh, oh okay you know, just selling stuff oh selling stuff yeah speaking of substances what's your top what's your drug of choice man what, what are you struggling right now with? uh my main drug is heroin but uh uh right now uh Currently, I'm struggling with methamphetamines. Meth as well? Methamphetamines, yeah, and uh, I already have a mental uh, problem. So the uh, methamphetamines uh, real, uh, uh, becoming a real problem with my uh, mental uh, state because uh, uh, I'm finding it hard to uh, cope with control that. with my, my uh, uh, movements and how I act and the way I talk. I feel like I got to... Uh, relearn 
everything and I feel out of my body, I don't feel right. The right. drug is really bad, it's really addicting, but I've, I've found, I don't know why, I just a crave or a, a like to it. But I guess it's just being out of my mind, not there, dumb. Yeah. I guess I just don't want to, you know, sometimes think about or nothing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, uh, I know you mentioned uh, you went to rehab at one time before. Yeah. How long did you stay there? Uh, I hardly, uh, hardly stay, uh, hardly stay too long at a rehab. If I check into a rehab, right? I usually stay there for uh, what was a, month, a month or two. What was this at? What what what, what rehab? What facility? Uh, there was a few rehabs I've been to, but uh, okay, Charlie's. Uh, or? Charlie, I've been to Charlie's. Uh, I didn't I didn't check in though, but uh, I went to Charlie's. Uh, I went to Phoenix House. I went to uh, I went to a few. Uh, Okay. Yeah. yeah, man. Uh, maybe uh, it, maybe it's uh, we can look into that again. You know, give it another try. Maybe hopefully uh, they can help you out again. You never know. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, that's another thing. I'm, I'm gonna provide you with uh, some uh, some resources. You know what I'm All saying? Right. That way you can get get that help that that you need right now. So how old were you when you got introduced to those substances? I was uh, 15 years old. Uh, my my cousins, uh, uh, my cousins on my dad's side of the family. Uh, introduced you to others? Yeah, it was the older uh, cousin, the older, uh, the older generation. Yeah, the older generation. By the way, do you have any kids, John? Nah, no kids. Really. No kids? Nah. Okay. So, how was your how was your childhood when you were growing up, John? Uh, my childhood was like every other child's, you know. It was just, it was just, uh... You had both parents when you were growing up? Nah, I man. I was a child and I, uh, you know what I'm saying? I was like every other child, but. Yeah. You got siblings? Huh? Yeah, I got siblings. It was me and my brother though growing up. Okay. What type of work do you used to do? Are you still, are you looking for work? Construction, huh? Construction, remodeling. Uh, I did remodeling with my uncle uh, okay. and uh, uh, some friends of mine that were uh, linked to my uncle uh, that did business together. Doing the remodeling? Uh, and they remodeling construction. <clears throat> hey John, I was gonna ask you, man, uh, when you when you look at uh, when you look at yourself in the mirror, what do you see? I see a confused and lost man. If you had three wishes, what would they be? Give me one of them. Make myself a man of God. I have a beautiful wife. And I own a, a good business, bringing in lots of money. Okay. Start your own business. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's good. Especially that uh, remodeling, yeah. construction. Yeah. What about people that, you know, due to your circumstances, John? Do what? Due to your circumstances, right. what you're going through, you know? Oh, my, my family, where they go, like... Well, I mean, what you're going through, you know, with the substances you right. know, and stuff, being homeless, is, what kind of advice will you give to these people that, you know, they're going through? I mean, well, I'm not, I'm not a, a advisor or whatever you call it. I don't know what that. Right. Uh, I don't, I don't give advice. Uh, just, you know, I like to talk, but <laughs> yeah, I'm not no preacher, but. Uh, I just say enjoy life and just life. love what what you're doing. And don't you know, don't ever stop loving what you're doing or uh, or who you are or, or what it is and what what it ain't because what it ain't is what it is and what it is is what it is. Yeah. So if it's ugly and you can't stop it, well then. <laughs> Let it be. It, it's not. It, it, it's it's fire. You can't stop it. Let it be. You need it, but I mean, it hurts. We don't need it, but we do need it. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
I guess like I guess I guess it'd be like water. I mean, or no, like you know, what I'm saying? you need it, but you don't. But you know, can't like, do it without it. You know, like this new generation. You know, like women. Yeah, <laughs> you can't live with them or live without. Them. People like they're struggling. You know, they wanna trying to get in. You know, trying to experiment with uh, meth or that yeah. hair on. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. What kind of advice would you give to these people that they willing to be kind of? Well, what you're doing, and don't, 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 don't let the, don't let the, don't let people fool you. That, that, yeah. That you know, what I'm saying? Don't, don't let people fool you. Right. Drugs ain't ain't the way to go. It, drugs. Stay drug free. Stay away from the drugs. You know, I mean, weed is cool, but you know, it's getting to the point where it, 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 it's it's legal nowadays. You know, it, 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 I mean, it's coming to the point where you can get it at a, a corner store, uh, CBD or whatever the fuck it's called. Anyways, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's always gonna be there, and it's, and it's always gonna be what it is. So it's no rush into getting into it, you know, and destroying your life, you know, or never you could, you know, done it somewhere along the road, you know. Yeah. And focus true. on, you know, what I'm saying, focus on what is important in life. You know, you're a kid, you're a child, you know. I mean, right. you're a grown being. You're a child, but you're a full-grown child. So yes, you're grown boy but you're still a boy boy right so like yeah i didn't know what my dad was saying you know what I'm saying whenever i was you know what I'm saying snapping back at him whenever he was trying to tell me something to do but right right but but yeah you no know, i still have that but <laughs> right but 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 yeah. dad you know but i see what he meant though just just yeah. don't let that uh don't lifestyle uh yeah. Try not to uh, get caught up in this shit. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, I noticed uh, you went through a lot of struggles, a lot of difficulties in life, man. Well, it's my mind, bro. It's Your not. Mind, you got I, I don't let. I don't mind sleeping on the side of the road. I don't mind sleeping in the tent. I don't mind sleeping in the house. I don't mind. I don't mind where I sleep. I don't. I don't mind. I don't mind it. You know. It's, right, right. It's not. It's not a. It's not. It's nothing for the body to adapt to its surrounding. Yes. The body could go wherever you put it, and it'd be okay. But I mean, they had, if your body is, I, in my words, I'll say a pussy. If you got a pussy body. Well, then yeah, you're gonna puss up pupils, and you're gonna have acne, and you're gonna have uh, uh, all kinds of shit wrong with you, but. Yeah, the body's a body, so yes. wherever you put it, I mean, it's gonna adapt. So, right. I mean, I'm not, I'm not a, uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm not, I would say I got spoiled, you know what I'm saying? Right. These drugs spoiled me, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, right. it's, I want it now, I want it yeah. okay. whenever I bought it. I don't want it whenever I bought it in later that I can get it now, I want it now. It's my shit, I bought it now, I want it now. I want to right. fucking finish it, I want to down it. Yeah. I want to stay fucked up, I want to stay fucking high. I can't right. stay high. Who the fuck are you to tell me I can't stay high? Right. I'm in my right fucking mind. Are you? Right. Yeah, but they say no. But whenever my mind is running, my mind is racing, or my mind is acting. Yeah, so going to 100 miles an hour, man. Even that, it is not moving that fast. You say it is, they say it is. My mind ain't even moving, bro. It's dead. It's not going 100 miles an hour. It has no thoughts. It does not think no more. Yeah. So hey, well, I think God's controlling you. Yeah. So when well, listen, the devil's yeah. controlling you. Yeah. It's yeah, spirits. Sorry. Yeah. Hey, John. So, what do you say, man? Uh, I feel like I'm a dead corpse just walking around with spirits controlling me. Yeah. What do you say if we, uh, we can kind of give you a, a new look, man? Uh, I love some that, clothes, man. man. What do you say? We, I love like, that. All right, I man. I love shower. I love some food. Get you some new. Get in between. You know what I'm saying? Right. Get you some new uh, shoes. Very so, You know, some more. Uh, yeah, that'd be nice. Okay, cool, man. You, you down with that? All right. Yeah, bro. Okay, well, listen up. Uh, 
let's go ahead and do that and uh, we'll come back man i would like you know appreciate it see you the before and after see what's up i'm saying you give every all appreciate right it, man we'll be back all right man appreciate it guys so we're back man let's see uh old john the after man running shoes and earth and john so what you think man i uh, appreciate it and i like it it's a lot more comfortable more comfortable huh yes sir it smell good it smell clean new right right I yeah. appreciate it. Yeah, you're welcome, man. That's why. That's a, that's the reason I like doing this, John. Trying to help people that. Yes, sir. They, they're going through a lot of struggles, you know. We all do on a daily basis. Yes, sir. We do. And I appreciate what you do. Yeah, man. You're welcome, dude. Uh, but also, let me let me give you this. All right. A little. Uh, Thank you. Appreciate uh, it. Personal hygiene kit, man. All right. Help you out. Also, on that kit, man. There's some. Different agencies, you can go and look for for any type of help. You know what I'm saying? All right. Mental, Appreciate it. Yeah, mental health. Mental health? Mental health and all that. All right. Yeah, yeah you're good on that. Struggling with those substances and all that, they're going to help you out, man. Those people will want to help you out. Okay, bro. You know what I'm saying? Thank you, sir. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. No, I appreciate you. What y'all doing? Yeah, you work. And before I let you go, man, that's for you, from, from all of us, man. All right. Thank you. This is how we like to, you I'm know. Gonna, uh, I like the white feather. It's white. What do you think that white feather represents, John? Uh, probably the white dove. The white maybe. Dove. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know, but it's white, and I like it. It's white. To us, it's like... Let me ask you now, you believe in angels, John? Yes, sir. Okay. I believe in angels. Yeah. I believe in messenger, messenger, messengers, angels, and demons. Okay. In God. All right. With that said, man, uh, I just want to say thank you, man, for for your time, dude. And I yes, sir. Wish I you the best, you. man. Try to get some help. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to be easy, but it's possible. Yes, you know sir. What I'm saying? Hopefully, you make some better choices in life in the future. And hopefully those three wishes that you, you wish for, they'll come true. Yes, sir. Never give hope, give up hope, you know what I'm saying? But uh, you don't mind if I share this on my YouTube channel, man? Nah, go ahead. You can yeah, uh, go ahead for your, uh, for your, uh, for your job, yes, sir. All right, yeah. man. Well, thank you, man. Well, yes, well you take care, bro, okay? All right, you too. All right.